It's the National Football League on EA Sports. And coming up, we'll get a look at Ezekiel Elliott. He's riding high after last week, over 250 yards on the ground. It's the Cards and the Bengals, and it's coming up next on Madden Football. Some of those in the silver-haired community would say it's a great day for golf, and it is, don't get me wrong, but we say it's a great day for football, and the roof is wide open here in Glendale at State Farm Stadium. Today we've got a Week 5 matchup in store here, as it'll be the Cincinnati Bengals taking on the Arizona Cardinals. With Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon. Charles, you look at this Cardinal team as they get ready here. It's been all systems go in this first month. They're off to a 4-0 start. And it's got folks believing that this is a team that's built to go all the way. You can't. So out come the Cardinals now for their opening drive. And they will be led out by a guy certainly still trying to prove himself here in the league, the young rookie quarterback. And he's been playing at an elite level here in this early half of the season. Tops in the league in touchdown passes at this point. This is definitely a wide-open offense, and we'll see if he can keep his string of good games going right here. They'll come out throwing here on first down. This will be caught downfield by Moore. And they work this well upfield across the 45. 23 yards, the final tally. Now a shotgun snap as they'll look to throw. And incomplete on the deep ball. The Cardinals are the perfect 4-0 to start the campaign. And they've been playing their best football of the year, winners of four in a row. And I thought that they played pretty well last week. Their execution, their discipline, their resilience. Ezekiel Elliott going to take it the distance. Touchdown, Cardinals. Ezekiel his eighth rushing touchdown of the year. And the Cards need just three plays to go down and take the early lead. You get in a second and long situation down here in the red zone. I'd say most defensive coaches would think pass. Let's bring some pressure. So this. So the Cardinals offense back onto the field here for their second drive of the game. They've got a 7-0 lead in the football as well as they start out first and 10. They start on the ground with Elliott. Up past the 25 to the 26, a gain of 5. And after his performance last week, everybody saw it unbelievable. You can expect a heavy dose of him again, I think. Without a doubt. I mean, why wouldn't you? Because once you establish yourself that way, it's not just him, okay? It's his offensive line, it's a tight end, it's your wide receivers, everyone now sharing in the load and sharing in the belief that they do their job, they'll see another performance just like they saw the week before. Third down and one. And they'll try and run the option to pick it up. And they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. And that one will go for 13 yards on the keeper. And a first down. Well, I tell you, there is no antidote for speed, even at the quarterback position, as he keeps it himself and turns it into good yardage. And it still takes time for a defender to react, even as quarterbacks carry the ball more and more in today's NFL. They're still a little bit in disbelief and realize, oh my goodness, he's running with the ball. He may be 8, 10, 12 yards downfield at that point. From just across the midfield stripe, here's second down and two. Here's a play fake as they set up to throw. And that would caught downfield by Pascal. And all the way inside the 15 before they drop it. It's a gain of 35. There's the arm strength that we saw in college and during the scouting process. And really, it's not just the arm strength there, but the placement as well. To me, that was an excellent combination of arm talent and accuracy. Ready. 
So how about this for field position after the big play? Inside the 15 now as they come up on first and 10. They'll drop to throw. And that is caught. Touchdown, Cardinals. Zach Ertz, his sixth touchdown of the season. And the Cardinals are off to a 13-0 first quarter lead. You do the analysis, partner, but with every touchdown pass this young quarterback throws and with the success that his team has had, I just continue to be more and more impressed. Let's both do the analysis. Impressed, aren't we both? Yeah. I mean, and why shouldn't we be? We've seen him improve throughout the year. We've Their quarterback in this offense heading back out to the field. He threw a touchdown pass last time they had it. And he'll look to get him in the end zone again here as they start with a first down. They'll start the drive with Elliott. Shoves him aside. And they're going to get this beyond the 40 before he's taken down. 82 yards rushing now for the NFL leader coming into this ball game. With that last carry, he's now over 8,000 career rushing yards. All right, big applause. Lots of clapping for this one, right? Think about it this way. Along the way, he's passed Hall of Famer Terrell Davis, and now he's starting to approach another Hall of Famer in Larry Zonka. And Cardinal first down on a gain of 13. Play action. They'll throw. A uh, short one here caught by McBride. And the result here, a pickup of eight. Leaves him with two to go on second down. That's a staple of this offense. Drag route to the tight end. Yeah, he's unable to use his size to break off much more yardage after the catch, but still an effective gain nonetheless. The throw right sideline here is complete. He's going to go out of bounds, but he takes this one down just shy of the 20. Coming into the week, he's the NFL's leader in receiving yards. There's his first catch, and it's good for a first down. They're going to look to throw. And this ball incomplete. Uh, looked very much to be a catchable ball and could not hang on. Second down coming up. Right up to that point, I was about to say, he's had a pretty good half catching the football, but let's just be honest about it. He should have caught that one. And he knows that. That was one right in his bread basket and one he normally catches. Touchdown, Cardinals! Marquise Brown, a 22-yard touchdown, Brown. And the Cardinals add six to their lead. Charles, every time that he makes one of these plays, I, I think the front office, they get a bigger and bigger collective smile because they feel more confident that they have found their guy, their future at quarterback. And they should feel that way. It's obvious he's a big part of why they have such a good record this season. You're right about the bright future as well, and by association, a bright future for the franchise too. their quarterback with this offense to take over once more. He already with a couple of touchdown throws in this first half as his guys start first and ten. throwing here to start the drive eluding the pressure right and that went too far in front he couldn't reel it in it's incomplete but that was an interesting look there because as soon as he got outside the pocket I thought he was going to take off and run for yardage but what often happens now with these quarterbacks who can move defenses want to try and keep bodies in front of them and I think that discouraged him from taking off and made him try a pass downfield that fell incomplete a game there of 30 big ones. This offense is looking very comfortable here in this first half. Very relaxed, very smooth, very efficient. No wasted motions. Things are definitely going their way, and they continue to move the ball downfield. 
So the big play moves him all the way across midfield. It's first and 10 from the 45. Inside give to Elliott. And not a whole lot of room to operate there on the first down run. He gets maybe three. Yeah, I don't know if it's exactly a win-win, but if you're on offense, you'll take that kind of a run, all right? It was kind of stacked up, found a little bit of yardage, and frankly, they're pretty close to staying on schedule on offense. The playbook is still open for the coordinator. On second down, Elliott once more. And the lane closes up quickly as he'll get about three down to the 38. Two minutes remaining in this first half of football. A reminder that when halftime rolls around, Jonathan Coachman will have all the highlights and analysis of this first half of play from our studios in Orlando. This now a third and four. Back to throw. They'll set up the screen to Elliott. He's got room at the 30, and he's got another first down as the tackle's going to be made at the Bengals' 25-yard line. They give him 13 yards there on the play and a fresh set of downs. And when you have success throwing the football, the old cliche becomes true. The playbook opens up wide, and these screen passes, they become even more difficult to stop. to throw now on first down. And he takes a shot on the release as this will be incomplete. So it looks like they still have some fight in them on this series because it seemed like things were headed for the red zone. But this defense gets two more stops. They can keep them out of that area. Now here's a throw right side taken in by his tight end. Nine yards, not quite enough. And they'll be left now with third and one. Let's not quibble about the game there on second down. That was a positive play because that was a take-what-you-can-guess situation. Got out to the tight end. Now it gives a much better opportunity to convert on third down. This will be play number eight here on the drive. It's third and a yard. They'll look to throw again. Looking in zone, but it's incomplete. What an excellent defensive stand there in the red zone. Nice tight coverage. They certainly recognized how important it was to bring up fourth down here. And no signs of the field goal unit. They're going for it on fourth down. The play action fake. They'll look to throw. Pass taken in by his big tight end. And the Cardinals are going to have first and goal as they try to finish off this drive with six points. The field goal attempt was well in hand. They had that, but they decided to go for it anyway. Extreme confidence, it looks like. Yeah, but I bet the defense is going to remember this one, right? They kind of rubbed their nose in it. They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. Looking left side, and he's got a man. That's Elliott. They stop short. Down at the one. Had the great move, but couldn't get it all the way home. Nice gain of eight that time, and it's second and goal. So here are the Cardinals to take over. They're working on a four-game winning streak, and they lead this one as well right now as they start first and ten. They'll start this drive out on the ground. Oh, Zeke with a quick feet and brought down, but not before reaching the 45-yard line. 118 yards for him on the ground now as he has been terrific here this afternoon. 
He's turning in a pretty impressive performance running the football and a big reason why they have this nice lead. And in days gone by, we would clip this out and put it up on the refrigerator, wouldn't we? Clip out the box score. Nowadays, not too many newspapers out there. Maybe you screenshot it online. The big play to start him out. Has him at the 45 already. Here's the option. And he'll lose yardage here. Back at the 41. Across the line and to the ball quickly there, Trey Hendrickson. But sometimes that option can get bogged down before the gears really even get into motion, and I think that's what we saw there. And I think what he saw, he saw a defensive end right in his face because he looked up and he was right there. Didn't even have a chance to get going. And he'll get it down to the 47 here. 11 yards is the gain on the keeper there, but now it's third down. Coming up here looking for three yards to pick up the first. Off the play fake, he'll look to throw. He lets this one fly toward the back of the end zone. He's got his man. It's caught in the end zone. Touchdown, Arizona. Hollywood, Marquise Brown with his second touchdown of the afternoon. And the Cardinals are able to extend their lead. Well, to put it mildly, he's been able to dice up this secondary all game long, and this time, that was a missile that he threw into the end zone and adding another touchdown to his ledger. And I think we see these youngsters develop a lot quicker than we ever have because when they get started in this game, they're not just throwing passes around. They're reading coverages early. So now they're like... the Arizona offense now as they get set to take over. Their lead down to two scores after the touchdown a moment ago as they start with a first and ten. They'll start this drive out on the ground. And shedding through the tackle. There's a nice move. That's a run to run now. And he'll be taken down, but not before they reach the 50. 25 yards to pick up there and also a first down. Good pick up by Elliott. What's a down year for Zeke? It's a great year for most NFL backs. Her career lows and carries in yards, but still ranked in or near the top 20 league-wide. And, of course, remained a productive scorer with 12 touchdowns. From the midfield strike, they'll look to throw. And he knocks the ball away, and it falls incomplete. Zone coverage there, and they were playing deep. That makes it obviously a little bit harder to run by, guys. And that time, there was not much of a window to get the ball in there, and it winds up incomplete. And he'll get it down here to the 43. Give him seven there on the tuck and run, and they're in better shape now for third. Three quarters in the books. We'll return with more after this. This is the NFL, and it's on EA Sports. Welcome back to the desert. We're in Glendale. It's Cardinal football. They're also out in front of the scoreboard as we get set for the fourth. The Cardinals on third down. They've been good. Three for four thus far. This time it's third and three. And that's Elliott complete. Room to maneuver at the 35. And he'll get this to the 30-yard line before crossing over out of bounds. A Cardinal first down on a gain of 13. The passing game continues to be their friend. Even with a stable lead here in the fourth, Charles, they're going back to that well. Yeah, with their overall philosophy, you know that they trust their quarterback. He's been able to throw it well. They continue to throw these safe passes. Who can blame them? Hey! 
So first and 10 now from the 30. 10th carry now for Elliott. Pushing through the contact. And oh, he spins past him and into space. And he gets it all the way down inside the 10 and mark him at the 5. And hold on here because on that last run, it looks like we have a player who was shaken up. While they come out and take a look at him, we will step aside for just a moment. A good chance now to put this game on ice. This is first and goal. On first and goal, they'll try the option left. And he will get into the end zone. Touchdown, Arizona. A great play there. Keeping it himself from five yards out. And the Cardinals add on to their lead, and they are also closing in on a fifth straight victory. offense ready to set up shop if they can score here they have a chance to make this a three possession game and all but put things to bed coaches that have a reliable running game they breathe a little easier on the sideline yeah they love the idea that they can take the air out of the football at this point of the game that means they're really counting on that offensive line counting on the runners taking care of the football because you got to tell your quarterback hey no time to be a hero we're not gonna throw it here just eat up that clock and if you have the ball they can't score just what you want on a first down run call it eight yards and it's second and two Able to stay in bounds, so the clock keeps rolling. And this defense right now backed up in the red zone. Another touchdown, it's over. They've got to stand tall quickly. Been in this spot before. Now there's a little bit of desperation creeping in, and all you're doing when you're talking to your defensive teammates is first guy there, hold him up. Second, third guy in, rake it the football. Get it out. We've got to create a turnover because one more score, and this game's over. Second and two. He'll get this out wide here to Elliott. Touchdown! Ezekiel Elliott. He scored on the ground and through the air. And the Cardinals are well on their way to a 5-0 start as they extend their lead. Yet another touchdown in what has just been a high-scoring affair, a fun one to watch. And it's the rookie quarterback, Charles, coming through with yet another touchdown pass to pad the lead. Did we come into this game where defense was optional? Because it certainly feels that way, right? But when you look at the scoreboard, this rookie, he has his team moving a little bit quicker pace than his opponent. The entire offense is going to get plenty of praise. The football going back over to Arizona now. And a few kneel downs should just about do it. Now, defensively, they do have all three timeouts, but... Very little reason to use him at this point. We've got to have two hands on the football here as they run on first down. Ezekiel Elliott going to take it the distance. Now the Bengals going to use the first of their timeouts as they'll get it with just over 90 seconds to go in the ballgame.
So the big play means just like that, they'll operate from the red zone now on first down. They keep on the ground with Allen. The Bengals going to use the second of their timeouts as they'll get it with just under 90 seconds remaining. So second and nine, and you'd have to figure just about all 11 probably crashing the line here. like he'll throw here. Burt has it left side. Touchdown, Cardinals. Zach Ertz with his second touchdown of the game, number seven on the year. And the Cardinals tack on another score as they have dominated this fourth quarter. So they get their tight end away from the line to the outside, and he works his way in for six. Tight ends are not just blockers anymore. I don't know how many more times we need examples, but here's a great one. Gets to the outside. They give him the ball pretty quickly, and they trust him to get those extra yards. And boy, did he come through pulling his way into the end zone after the nice catch. Arizona's offense back out and ready to go. And they've got this one in hand. No timeouts remaining defensively, so this one should just be one kneel and then handshakes. So he'll take a knee here to wrap this one up, and he's going to want to keep that game ball. He was sensational. Charles, a lot of happy faces heading into the tunnel as this one ends, and understandably so. Not only did they get the win, but boy, their offense was on fire in this ball game. And partner, I have no idea what the top speed is on one of those high-end sports cars. What's the top gear you can get into? This offense, they certainly were there in this one, huh? Everything clicking for them in this contest, the kind of performance that they're going to cherish. So for Arizona, they improved to 5-0 now on the young season. And they will hit the road next week. Meanwhile, for Cincinnati, the loss will move them back to 3-2 on the year. And they'll get a chance to redeem themselves at home next week.